Hey, what's up everyone and welcome back. My name is Captendo and I am in a world that I have been going to since like 2019. It is, I would say it's probably one of, if not the first My Hero Academia avatar world that I went to. And this one has a lot of cool avatars as well. But in today's video, I'm trying to remember what his name is. I think it's Tamaki Ama Akamichi Amaki, uh, Tamaki Amakiji Akamichi. No, that's Naruto, Akamichi. <laughs> it's one of those things. I call him Squid Boy, okay? That's that's my problem, is I, I play him in the strongest hero game. I call him Squid Boy, <laughs> even though I know it's an octopus. And that's why I can't remember his name because that's the nickname I gave him. Now, the world I am in for today's video is a PC world called My Hero Academia Avatar World over here by Oracle Lottle. And once you get into this world, like I said, this world has a lot of different avatars. It has three different sections as well. So you have this section off to the right with, uh, what's his name? Jeff Kaplan, the guy from Overwatch. It has his face over there. That's one of the avatar rooms. You have this avatar room over here in the middle that says Takato Matsuki or something. Then you also have this other section behind their Discord community. I don't, I don't see a name over there. But they do have these teleporters over here. So let's see, this is the teleport to Takato. So that's that room over there. Then we have this one to Jeff's area, which is that room over there. And they also have a teleport up to like a second floor, which is uh, more avatars. But we're gonna go over here and click on this teleport to the Jeff's area. So once you get over here, you will click on this box to turn on the avatars. And the avatar is gonna be over here in the UA students category. So we are going to go over here and here's the Tamaki Amajiki. That's what it is. <laughs> Tamaki uh, Amajiki Squid Boy is what his name is. <laughs> now I picked this avatar for today because I liked what this avatar did. I always remember what this avatar does and I'll go ahead and set this here. So what this avatar can do is we have a, uh, oh, here we go. So he can, <laughs> he can get the little octopus tentacle things to come out of his hand. Now, um, depending on which hand you're doing it on, you can like change how they're pointed out. Whoops, you don't want to see that one yet. And you just get his little octopus tentacle hands or whatever. Now, that's the grip button. I'm doing that on my left hand. You could do it on your right hand too to do that. And then to get the uh, octopus tentacle with like the crab shell stuff or whatever, and he also gets wings. That is going to be your thumbstick and your trigger clicked in at the same time. Now with this, woo, they go crazy when I move. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you can swing it around and stuff. That's really cool. But if it still works the same way as it used to, it seems like it moves a lot more, it's a lot more wiggly than it used to be. The little crab claw hands at the ends are seats. So someone could sit on those seats and you could actually like, <laughs> You could actually move them around. I've used that to like put people up like outside of walls and stuff before or up on like some place we couldn't reach or whatever. So I've done that before. So that was pretty cool. But that's if it still works the same way. So uh, if it does work the same way, I guess this. Oh, he looks just as nervous as I am. <laughs> if it does work the same way, then I can just put this in the um, the uh, writable avatars category because then you would be able to like have people sit on it. Now, I don't think this would be fun to sit on because look at how crazy they go. <laughs> you just be like, like that. <laughs> it's, it's too crazy. But yeah, so technically it, you should be able to sit on it. Now, as for anything else this avatar can do, I don't think so. Let me go check the expressions menu. Uh, it's got some dance moves, zero gravity, dab, godly, orange justice. It's just got a bunch of different dances and stuff as well. So that is pretty much it that this avatar can do. But I wanted to show this one off because I thought that was really cool how it had all the the tentacle ones, the the thing, whatever there, the claws and all that stuff. And I always remember that you could have people sit on them. But anyways, that is going to be it for today's avatar. I thought this was a cool avatar. I hope you guys do as well. And if you do, they have a ton of My Hero Academia avatars in this world. They have like a lot. I even saw they had some enemies and stuff too. So I don't know. Be sure to go check out this world. So that's going to be it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.